They're the best-selling vehicles in the United States, and their sky-high profit margins keep the lights on for more than one automaker. CarGurus was fortunate enough to test nearly every light-duty pickup truck on the market in 2016. Let's see how they all measure up in this year's CarGurus Truck Roundup. Mid-sized trucks generally range from about $25,000 to $35,000, making them an attractive option for shoppers who need towing and hauling capability, but don't want to invest in a full-size truck. General Motors brought the fight to Toyota and Nissan back in 2015, as the Chevy Colorado and the GMC Canyon exploded onto the then-Japanese-only mid-sized truck scene. Their advantage as all new models was short-lived as Toyota introduced a redesigned Tacoma in 2016, but the Nissan Frontier, despite its proven off-road ability, still begs for an update. The American-made Colorado and its Canyon Twin were decidedly designed as work-first, off-road second vehicles. Bumper steps make getting in and out of the bed easy, and the only diesel engine in the mid-size truck segment delivers workmanlike towing and hauling abilities. Step inside and the ample storage and plentiful cup holders make the Colorado a convenient truck. Add remote start, heated seats, multiple USB ports, and Chevy's MyLink infotainment system, and it becomes clear. The Colorado is as refined as it is hardworking. Toyota's all-new Tacoma entered 2016 with every intention of leveling the playing field between itself and the GM trucks. A new redesigned interior features a more refined look and updated technology like Toyota's Entune infotainment system and a wireless charging pad. Yet it still manages to hold on to the truck's tough look. While the Colorado seems more focused on towing and hauling, the Tacoma specializes in heading off-road particularly the TRD off-road trim, which features a multi-terrain select system and hill descent control. And then there's the Nissan Frontier. The Tacoma received an update to compete in the newly bolstered segment, but the Frontier is still driving on a 12-year-old platform. Although the Frontier is definitely cheaper than the competition, with its base S trim starting at just over $18,000, it's definitely a get-what-you-pay-for situation. The more expensive Frontier Pro 4X includes some nice features like its 5.8 inch touchscreen and Rockford Fosgate stereo, but that S trim is missing even basic features like air conditioning, cruise control, and a CD player. Still, Nissan has built a function first truck with the Frontier, delivering a spray in bed liner and adjustable cargo tie downs as standard equipment. Trucks will always be compared by their towing capacity, and GM leads the way, with the diesel Colorado and Canyon topping out at 7,700 pounds. Their 1,450 pound payload is also best in class, and the diesel engine delivers up to 29 miles per gallon on the highway. Try as they might, Toyota and Nissan simply can't match those numbers. Sometimes, however, you need a truck for serious work and even the Chevy Colorado can't compare with a full-size pickup. These trucks deliver more capability, but for a price, costing anywhere from less than 30 grand for a basic pickup to close to 70 grand for a luxurious top-of-the-line trim. The Chevy Silverado 1500 carries over many of its features and specifications from the 2015 model, and the Toyota Tundra offers everything from basic truck capability to upscale luxury in platinum trim. Ram offers the only diesel engine in a full-size light-duty pickup with a 1500 Eco diesel, and Ford continues to build on the F-150's reputation as a cutting-edge pickup with the addition of some advanced truck-specific driver assistance features. The Silverado is one truck Cargurus didn't test drive in 2016, but very little has changed from the 2015 model. A new front end arrives, and the LTZ and High Country trims V8s are now paired with Chevy's efficiency-focused 8-speed transmission. Other than those details, the 2016 is largely a carryover from 2015. 
Chevy still delivers the strongest V8 in the class with a 6.2 liter pumping out 420 horsepower and 460 pound-feet of torque. OnStar and 4G LTE Wi-Fi hotspot capability also return along with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, making the Silverado the only 2016 full-size truck with this technology. You can pay to get some nice features in the Toyota Tundra's Platinum trim, like the power side view mirrors, quilted leather, heated and ventilated front seats, and a JBL sound system, but it all runs on a comparatively unrefined platform. Mike Perkins, who grew up driving trucks, noted that the Tundra's hard, unforgiving suspension wasn't so different from those on the trucks of his youth. Few will find fault with the Tundra's available 5.7 liter V8, however, which comes standard with a 38 gallon fuel tank. The Ram 1500 Laramie Limited George Kennedy tested, on the other hand, is incredibly comfortable with its air suspension and plush interior. USB ports and a wall style power outlet keep you fully charged. Plus, the Ram's cubbies and cup holders put the Colorados to shame. Outside, the Ram features a bed extender, which you'll want if you go with a short bed configuration, and the optional Ram boxes add innovative storage to the truck's rear end. But what really makes the Ram 1500 stand out is its available 3 liter V6 eco diesel engine. With 240 horsepower and 420 pound feet of torque, the diesel engine pairs with Ram's 8-speed automatic transmission to deliver best-in-class fuel economy. Finally, the F-150. The classic American truck generated plenty of praise and a good bit of controversy when it adopted aluminum construction in 2015. For 2016, changes are less polarizing, but include Ford's infotainment upgrade to Sync 3, which has faster processing and better voice recognition than the outgoing technology. The 2016 Ford F-150 also features an optional 360-degree camera system, remote tailgate release, dynamic hitch assist, and the Pro Trailer Backup Assist system, which makes the trickiest part of towing well within the ability of even the greenest truck owners. Just like in the midsize segment, full-size trucks mostly compete on their capacities and capabilities. The F-150 and the Silverado, when properly equipped, will tow 12,100 and 12,000 pounds, respectively, and their payload capacities lead the field as well. In terms of fuel economy, however, nothing beats the Eco Diesel Ram's 22 miles per gallon in combined driving. Trucks may have more wildly loyal fans than any other vehicle type. For those looking at mid-size haulers, there's the off-roading Tacoma, the throwback Frontier, and the all-American Chevy Colorado and GMC Canyon. If you're in need of more grunt, you can choose between the Chevy Silverado, Ram's comfortable and efficient 1500 Eco Diesel, the V8-powered Tundra, or Ford's strong and light F-150. Let us know which one best suits your needs in the comments, and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more CarGurus roundups, reviews, and more. Thanks for watching.